I've always liked to look to the future and I have a radio show I, I'm keeps me on top of new music every single week called Sister Bliss in Session so um, that's what I do for the minute also writing a new Faithless album so starting to road test the new material um, I'm very much hoping that's going to come out next year okay so yeah I've been busy in the studio so the average day is a lot of working a lot of writing um, and running around doing various other things as well I'm doing a film score at the minute so I've right, got to deliver that in about three weeks I think are we allowed to know what it. film that's for um, yeah it's called um, how to sell a war and it's actually very current it's about fake news it's oh. a satire so yeah I'm very much looking forward to seeing that getting a bit more wrapped up so they finished all the shooting and they've only just finished editing it so so you almost my job begins busier now than you used to be um, I don't know if that's possible <laughs> I think, I think I've, I've always been busy but maybe that's because I always remember what it was like being on the dole and I always remember what it was like not having another DJ gig to look forward to or a live gig or an album or you know I'm always wanting to create in one way or another and I've been lucky enough to have a go at many different areas from you know composing music for films to writing albums to doing singles to doing sister bliss material um to writing music for the theater it sounds quite random yeah. doesn't it but i guess it's all part of the same thing do you think like your sound uh, has developed over those years into something different from when you started um i guess it must have done just sort of organically but i think the same the same things that move me and excite me in music are pretty pretty much the same as they've always been you know lyrics really you know a voice that somehow touches your soul really good beats really heavy bass you know there's so many ingredients that just speak to me in music that, that always have and, and also music that's hypnotic and I'm very glad that we're possibly moving a little bit away from the big EDM mm. you know peak drop kind of formula in music yeah. and that people are going back to records actually being a lot longer I'm getting a lot of promos now that are seven eight minutes long and I'm like yes because actually Faithless we made our name with you know our very first big hit Insomnia was at least eight minutes long the original version and I, actually that was something that um, I really felt Underworld gave the world was was how to make a really long record that was just hypnotic and would suck you in